Hi, my passionate ones, my lovely Taurus. Welcome back to my channel. It's time for your reading for the next week. So let's look together, my lovely Taurus. What messages and energies do we have for you for the sun, moon and rising sign in uh, Taurus? And if you are a cross watcher, as you already know, it can be vice versa, but doesn't have to be. You will know who is who here in this reading, okay? Let's start with your reading, my passionate ones. Overall energy for you for the next week. Uh, we have the Ten of sword, uh, Swords here, air energy, maybe you are dealing with air sign, but doesn't have to be. And also, as you already know, this reading can be connected to your love situation, to your professional life, or maybe some another situation or relationship in your life right now. Doesn't have to be for all of you, just romantic reading, okay? Uh, but Ten of Swords, you had enough. You had enough of this uh, bad behavior. Uh, someone betrayed you. Someone did you wrong. Someone uh, was so incorrect towards you. And you left this person. For some of you, you ended this relationship. Uh, maybe you were in a relationship with that person for 10 years, for some of you. Or you left the, jo the job. Also, it can be whatever is your case, okay? But you had enough because uh, they didn't respect you. They didn't value, uh, and they betrayed you. Uh, they did you um, dirty so, so bad here with this uh, Ten of Swords. Uh, and uh, you left this person, this energy in the past. And uh, you are going towards um, this fresh, light energy. Uh, look at in this uh, look at her in this um, in this card she is uh, leaving this all bad vibes behind and she is going towards new something new bright brighter future uh, yes the the fool the air um, aries energy maybe you are dealing with aries but uh, she is or he doesn't matter the gender uh, she is um, ready to take this leap of faith to go towards unknown. She doesn't know what awaits her in the future, but uh, she's brave enough to, to just to, to go in new direction, uh, towards um, something new. Uh, this is what I'm feeling. And yes, this is your card. You will find yourself again. You will win yourself back. You will find the right path for you, my lovely uh, Taurus, for whoever this uh, reading uh, is for. Uh, you will be happy again. Look at this is your major arcana. Uh, let's start with your reading. Uh, Nine of Wands. Um, we have here the, the first card. You don't trust this person. Uh, you are guarded. Of course you are, because they did you wrong. Uh, they did you dirty. They backstabbed you. Uh, and you don't trust them. Uh, you are guarded. You uh, hire your standards here. Um, you, respecting, you are respecting yourself. You are val val valuing yourself. Sorry. Uh, just just uh, stay in this energy, okay? Uh, the second card, the Empress, yes, you are in the middle of something new, new face, new life. Uh, for some of you also pregnancy, my ladies, watch out a, a little bit, okay, if you don't uh, want to get pregnant, for some of you. Um, but you are in the middle of something, uh, of new beginning in your life. Um, new person, new face, new life, whatever is your case, but we will get there, okay? Uh, and something that will provide for you stability in the long uh, run. This is what I'm feeling. Uh, high Priestess, we have here Pisces energy. Listen to your intuition, okay? Listen to this inner knowing, uh, inner guidance, because um, you can trust this energy. Okay, then we have for the uh, Nine of Wands clarifiers, for the Nine of Wands, Queen of uh, Wands, maybe you are dealing with a um, uh, fire sign here, Aries, Leo, Sag, uh, Six of Pentacles and the Ace of Swords. This person that did, did you wrong, they want to... Um, they want to speak with you. They want to make things right with you here, for sure, because uh, they are so attracted to you. Uh, and they know that they did you wrong. Believe me, they do, but you, you don't trust them because they crossed the line this time. This was not the first time that they did you wrong, but this time they crossed the line and you don't want to... Um, um, 
uh, low your guard to say like this uh uh you don't want to put your walls down uh uh, uh because you don't trust them you don't trust them because they cross the line this time and you have your dignity uh, and your respect and your self worth and you don't want to deal with this disrespectful uh, this disrespectful uh, energy and treatment anymore you don't trust their their promises and their attempts to make this right with you this is what I'm feeling here. Um, Empress. For the Empress, we have the Three of Pentacles here, the Four of Swords and the Hermit. Look at all this healing energy, uh, Virgo energy we have here. Um, yes, um, yes, they, they want to speak with you. They want to make things right. They want to do the right thing. This is what I'm feeling. They want this new beginning with you. But uh, you are not open for business because you don't trust them uh, this is the main message for some of you you are going towards new person for others of you yes in the near future you were um, you will be ready to speak with that person again and to give them a second chance but uh, you will know which story resonates with you but right now uh -uh, you are guarded you are not ready you are not ready because you don't trust them uh, you are still hurt uh, they hurt you so bad uh, this is what i'm feeling uh, the high priestess for the high priestess we have here Pisces energy we have the king of swords uh, someone is waiting for the communication and they are feeling trapped uh, but uh, you are not open for business you are not interested here for of uh, you are rejecting them rejecting uh, them for sure uh, with uh, this four of cups you don't want to accept their offer uh, you are not ready to speak you are not ready to speak with them uh, because you don't trust them. You are still hurt. This is what I'm feeling here. And yes, Empress, you are going towards, uh, yes, for some of some of you, Taurus, pregnancy is here uh, very, very strong. Um, we have the energy. Three times we have the Empress. You are uh, in the middle of the beginning of some new phase in your life. Uh, but we will see with who is this uh, this past person or uh, someone new is coming in uh, for you, my lovely Taurus. Uh, and I pulled a uh, few more cards for you as a bonus messages. We have first one, separation here. Uh, let me read for you. Sadness, missing you, thinking about you, uh, yearning, unsure of future. Yes, uh, they are yearning for you and they are unsure because uh, you don't want to um, speak with them. You don't want to accept them back. The Phoenix is the second card here. Uh, let me read for you. New face, rekindle, uh, renewal, transformation, growth, change mind. Yes, this is what we have in this reading. The new person and the ex person. For some of you, you will know who is who here. Or both, for some of you. Date. We have the third card here. Uh, meeting someone new. Yes. Uh, dating, get back out there. Plan, set a date. Uh, and uh, in the bottom of this deck, we have stepped in the back. Oh, yes, they did step you in the back. Uh, heartbreak, pain, separation, deception, shocking attack. Mm -hmm. This is why uh, you don't trust them and you are not ready to speak with this person um, right now because uh, they really, really crossed the line this time. This is what I'm feeling here. Um, I hope this reading will help to some of you. I'm wishing you a beautiful, beautiful week that is coming. Enjoy my lovely Taurus and don't forget, of course, good vibes, only kisses.